got stuck in a mind-bending trade with an old coin. 48-hour odyssey, a test of my will. $50,000 was on the line. I fought. I was relentless. I refused to give up. The day I shorted it, it was up 38%. It was out of place. I low leveraged it. I added money. I pulled my leverage back. I refused to give them my money. I was down $14,000 at one point. This is nothing, okay? I started going by my back end at one point. This was down to 39,000. I couldn't watch the front end anymore. I only looked at the back end and this trade started coming back. My back end started growing. And here we are now in real time at 18%. My fees are very little. 15%, $3,000, 17%. I believe it's going down more. I am not closing it. As a matter of fact, hold on, $3,300. Yes, I'm going to close and reposition now. Epic. Let's look at the back end. Epic. Came all the way back. It took me two days. No way, I was giving in, a loser. We have defeated the villainous altcoin. Now, I will go after Bitcoin, 100X. I'm going after her isolated, one, two, three, four. Let's do market, limit, market, limit, one, two, three, four. You know what? I want that altcoin again. What was it? Omni. What was our entry? 1586. I like this Bitunix exchange. My list of losers. Look at Notcoin up. Notcoin deserves to be slaughtered, but I'm not going after it now. Where is Omni? Come to pay the price. Where are you? There. I shall wait. Till they buy the dip. My revenge shall be swift and brutal. How dare you? I'll tell you, I win many, many trades like this by not giving in the will to win. I started with 50,000. They tried to hold me back. My back end was $39,000. I started taking screenshots. Then it was 48, and then I beat them. That's what it's about. I love this Bitunix exchange. How did I find this altcoin? Well, the other day I pulled my altcoin trick. If you're not experienced, become an expert in Bitcoin first. Welcome to War in the One Minute Chart. Look at not coin up so much. I don't want to do it on Friday when Bitcoin dumps. I attack these when Bitcoin is pumping and they over pump. Not coin is not even a coin. I have to ignore that. I want Omni. I want to go after it. Is it still going down? All right. Let's go ahead. I don't want to get stuck all the way down there again. Let's do 16. 2222. Two, two, two. Let me see the prices I watched it go. Oh, they won't let me do that. Network error. Okay, in the last hour it was sixteen twenty-eight. So I want to put a price in. Let's bring this down so they let me put more in the trade. So here's my move. Okay. In the last hour, the high price was sixteen twenty-eight. So I'm gonna place a limit order. Right now I'm winning. Okay. If it gets bought, it gets bought. I'm not going to ever let them pump against me like that again. No short. Now I'm also going to look at the high of the day. It went all the way to 1786. Well, at 16. 16 is a nice number for a thousand. One, two, three, four. No. Nope. Let's do 17 in case they go crazy over the weekend. 
And this is what I do when I'm done trading something. If they hit my price, they hit my price. This was 48 hours, you piece of crap. We're going to do a review of you. We're going to review you and see what you are, okay? That you took how long to pay me what was due to me? $3,200, okay? Let me see how you minimum waged me on this trade for my time, all right? 3,200 divided by 48 hours, okay? Look, oh my God! The number of the beast, it was the hell trade. I've never seen such a thing. Who would want to earn 600, you know, 66 dollars and 66, boy, I mean, who, that's horrible. The trade from hell, altcoins, destruction. The turd went as low as 1526 to let me out. I don't want no premature entry. And how high? 1786, huh? Market limit. 1786. You are not worthy. You are not worthy. So you can make big hits. Look, they're not, they're small percentages, but look at that. 30, that's on low leverage. 7X. Okay? $3,200. The fees are spit. Okay, when you go that low, don't trade Bitcoin like this. This is not how you do it. I do these looking for the next big hit. The price is coming back up. Schmuck nuts are buying on the one minute. Where are they? Let's look down. Look, there they are. Look at them. The obviously stupid. Now, every fiber of my being wants to short now. I have learned that intelligent shorting makes for intelligent cash outs. The link for Bitunex is below the video. I have a lot of windows open. That was one heck of a battle. So, we're all... 16 is the lowest price I would go in. Okay? And it hasn't been 16 in the last hour. In the last hour. Oh, it was 16.28. Okay? So, I'll take my chances with this because the altcoin market limit. I'll do one at 16.28. Wow, the number of the beast. Did you see that? That's insane. Trade from hell. Let's get rid of the low one. I don't want to be down begging her again. Hold on. $16. That's out. And we have two 1628s. Cancel one of them. It's early. You don't want to re enter the trade prematurely. I'll take a 16, a 1786. Yeah, I'm good with all of those. And what's great about this exchange is those are on isolated. Let's double check. Make sure they are on isolated. Never cross. Now let's add this turd, Omni, to my favorites. Who's buying the dip? Who knows? We're going to do a full investigation, okay, of what this is. It's going to be a story. Okay, Omni is added to my list of favorite losers. Okay, where are the rest of them? They're gone. Just Omni is the last one. Come, come to 16,000, you stupid altcoin. Come back to me. What you put me through. The ordeal. $50,000 was on the line. I had to put it all in the trade by reducing the leverage. This is not even half the story. The battle that persisted until the slaughter shot I knew eventually would come so my move is with these altcoins when Bitcoin pumps they over pump okay you got to do these on low leverage I'll show you sign up for Bitunix either pinned to the first comment or and it works great on this exchange or in the description click show more it's hard to find come by the Omni I gotta see what this Omni is but Come up here, click it. Go to all oh, favorite. I don't know what happened. I, I broke it. I broke it. I can't see nothing but Omni anymore. Hold on, I broke it. Oh, oh, you gotta take that out. This is how this works. So these, these were my favorite to beat up. See, like not should not be up, but Bitcoin is down. If Bitcoin comes back up, all of these come back up. So this is not a time to trade not token. 
normally we've shorted this in the past. It's worthless because it's not anything. It's not even USDT. So let's go to all. Tia had made me so much money. I don't even know how. All right. I, I, I think she slipped me in a roofie or something. I don't know. Bake. This is another great short, but we short these when they're up freakishly. I'm so tempted by not. But here's the problem. Bitcoin just dumped to below 66,000. Okay? If it pumps back up, not will come up too. We better off look at the others. Let's see. Let's go to all. I do this again. Bitcoin is dumping right now at this moment. Look, it is not a good time to short any altcoins. You must wait for Bitcoin to pump. And here's the trick. Here's the trick. Watch for the ones that over pump. So we're going to push the down thing. Look, these are, these are bad. And of course, it's not the time to do it. None of these are truly over pumped. I hate not. Hold on. All right. The other thing I look at too is you don't want to get trapped in one of these. The, the three minute, the one minute. Look. Even if I wanted to short knot right now, it's not pumping at this minute. I missed the move. I need should have shorted it there. It doesn't belong at the top of any list. It's not even worth anything. It's not even a token. We don't know what it is. It's made in Mumbai. Fourteen percent. So when you come here, you gotta make sure you click. Look, the right one. You want the highest ones. Don't try to short the low ones. That's like that's like being Canadian. It's kind of makes sense, but not really. So look, sometimes they'll be up 20, 30%. This piece of garbage, this dirty slut on me was up 38%. She stayed up for two days until today. I brought the hammer down. Subscribe. Were you notified? If not, they glitched you. You're in the matrix now. Right away. Unsubscribe immediately. Oh wait. Subscribe again. Click all notifications. Tell me in the comments. I resubscribe. Re-upped. Just write re-up. Re-up. We re-upped to the only most winning channel. Strategies. Not charts. Strategies, not charts. Now not such garbage. Ton ton may pump. We gotta watch out. You can watch them. Which ones are trying to run? They're like horses. Man, I want to short my. I'm gonna hold back. I'm gonna stick to my plan. I'm a winner. Understand? Straight up, clear, cut and dry. Even if they only paid me two thousand, I lost nothing to them. I fought to the end because all coins have no value other than paying me to win shorts and you can do it too join my discord group search oracle in my disc in my description box oracle discord and consultation oh it's an epic place but you can subscribe follow along as not coin crashes to the ground i want a piece of pen. all right just a small amount that i'm willing to lose just that at 10x Okay. All right. Because you don't deserve to be up. I don't like to do it when big points down. Oh, these are a local bottom. Oh, this is a mistake. Oh, it's not risky. Not. I want out of the not coin. I really want out. I want to just flash close it. It's like a lottery ticket. But I want out. It breaks all protocol. That is the disciplined winner. I shall wait. For Crapola Omni Token to come back to me. To the high of the hour. The high of the last 24 hours. And this time I will wait for her on the top of the hill. Nothing has changed. Her value has not changed from when we were down 2200. To when we were up 3200. Nothing has changed. Omni Token is garbage. All that matters is the entry and the exit. I entered against protocol, and I fought the law, and the law won. Well, not really, but I mean, I fought the battle, and I won because I was not emotional. I resorted to only looking at my back end number. That's it. I left that open on the computer. I knew where liquidation was. 
And a pro way, a pro wins by not staring. Men should not stare at goats. You should not stare at every tick if you're stuck. Know the parameters, protect your trade, walk the dog, bang a donkey if that's legal in your country, Borat, whatever. Let's check the price on Omni Network. It is now from 1526, it has moved up to 1578. Where is it? Omni, we isolate these because they have like some kind of disease. Yes, the fools are buying the dip. So that is how you fight the creation like a warrior. Links are below, subscribe, leave me comments. I want you to see how a pro does it. The biggest mistake I've made in learning how to leverage trade these altcoins is not checking if Bitcoin was at a local bottom. Because when Bitcoin rises, they all rise. The other thing is when Bitcoin dumps, I do not choose one from the list. Only when it pumps. Gravity is greater than hope. Now, if you don't want to get stuck like I did, you wait. Now the re-entry. Just like it had to come back to my price here for me to profit. Even when all hope was gone. Okay? I was down way more than this. I was down $14,000. I didn't save all the screenshots. At that point, I just looked at the back end. My back end was 39000 at its lowest. And I just watched that. I knew what my liquidation was. I don't stare. That's the key. The mistake I made was I didn't enter on its local three-minute top. I didn't wait for it to pump. What I'm doing now is using the same logic. If I miss, I'm a winner. But you know what? It's got to come back. I don't want to enter where I entered before, but I checked over the last hour and the last 24 hours. And since I'm already a winner and have nothing to lose, why should I rush into another trade? That's where the trouble happens. So look, all right, I'm going to be at 16, 1786, the high. And even at 1628 is great. Before, I had entered really low. 1586 this time i'm entering high links will be below the video really give this process a re-listen this is how you win have a great day